Oh my god. My twin flame sneezed one time and it cured poverty. It was crazy. You know? Like people follow her around the streets as she, as she just walks around. She just like shits diamonds and gems, rubies. Just excellence. I think I once saw her fly and she didn't even mean to. It's just pure excellence. Right? What putting putting your twin on a pedestal. This is like ideal, you know, idealization of of something, you know, putting putting your twin on a, on this pedestal that is just so out of reach. Um like Idealization is something that only exists as, as an idea in your mind, right? And you're, you're telling yourself that, like, this is just pure, like, perfection, this person. Like, I can never achieve that level of perfection, uh, so I just, you know, view it from afar. You know, they're way up there, I'm down here, like, suffering, and... It's never going to happen because I can't – you're telling yourself that you can't reach this level of perfection. And what you're doing is like, you know, you're telling yourself that like you're, you'll, you're not going to be good enough to get there, right? Like there's always going to be something um, that you could be better at. There's always going to be uh, a level that you need to achieve to get to where your twin is but you're one your twin is you you're on the same level always there's never a time that you aren't on the same level it's your idea your i you know you're idealizing that um that's the that the case is that they're up here and you're down here or however you're viewing it right and it's, you know, it's good to, to want to be uh, better and it's, and it's good to like have better things if you're doing it from the standpoint that it's causing you to go within yourself and, you know, locate places that you could fine tune things within yourself. Like you could, you could fine tune different ideas and uh, choices that you've made and, you can, and the result of that is making yourself better from within, you know, from that standpoint, uh, creating a better reality within yourself, uh, therefore projects a better reality outside of yourself. Um, you know, it's not good to, to want these, to, you know, want to be better or to need to be better or, or trying to achieve, uh, different things about yourself to be better because what you have or what you are or what you're being isn't good enough right now. You know, one, uh, one of those is fine tuning yourself, which is great. And the other is, you know, a pure lack mentality and, you know, like what you have and what you are isn't good enough. Like that's lack. And, that sense of lack is the absolute quickest way to avoid getting what you want and staying stuck where you are, right? Like um, you're idealizing what you want and it's really causing you like this mentality is causing you to uh, stay exactly where you are. Like you're keeping yourself away from something. So, you know, at the very least, um, by il uh, by idealizing something, you know, whether it's uh, your twin or uh, finances, a uh, house, uh, uh, you know, a really nice car, whatever it is, uh, what you're really doing is, you know, keeping yourself away. You're, you're moving into this lack mentality and you're separating yourself from the very thing that you want. So, you know, instead of focusing on what you don't have, um, 
what you're idealizing. Instead, you know, tune into yourself, tune into your heart and focus on what you do have. Be grateful for what you do have. Be present uh, in, in each very, in each and every moment uh, with yourself for the things that you have. You know, this, that being present is what manifests things. Being present is what's going to raise your vibration to uh, be in union, right? You don't get or have union. You are union. You, you become union. So, you know, really focus on, on what it is that uh, you're telling yourself and, and, and where your, what, what your viewpoint is on um, everything that's happening, right? Like, you're one. Realize that. Understand that, like, they aren't leaps and bounds ahead of you. You aren't leaps and bounds ahead of them. They aren't riding in on a crystal chariot. Oh, I'm going to ride in on my crystal chariot everywhere I go. That's not the case. You know, bring it down to earth here. That's where we are. Bring it down to the place that you are. Right? Visit asoneguidance.com. Uh, check the description box down below uh, the video for all the links to my website and how I can help you with coaching sessions and uh, you know, check out my, my e-course to building your foundation to unconditional love. And I will see you next time.